I don't come this house to, to play with any motherfucker. I think we'll chop anything else. You get a dog break with no, no, no. <laughs> You go break leg, you go break leg. You go. Know. She's working on eggshells. She's not going to play into your trap. Big conversation with her and clear up the animosity. I don't want to. She will let her guards down. No. You saw it, babe. Yeah, I saw it too. Yeah. What you saw was different in Victoria that I already knew from before. What Victoria? I see this house. Many things are happening. Not me listening to when Ruti was speaking on how she missed Mayor in the house, like missed having Mayor in the house, and Kelly Ray asking her, How are you both outside? And you know, she said they're waxing stronger. In my head, I was like, Oh, this one don't they lose God do at least she don't they mellow down. But the next minute, here is Ruti telling Chinwe, Did you notice how Nelly kept on dancing, looking at you? you know dancing like the both of you are competitors or something that she was just saying hmm, i beg you cover up that even with her own big tummy that she has a better body type a better shape than nelly and they both laughed about it and she now said low budget messieke and she when you say no that's even calling her low budget messieke is a promotion because she no rich that that one is is just to make it make it feeling funky and they started laughing too. And then Ruthie said, Now, nah, now nah, I don't they see that 40 years where you tell me through through that she is. So it means that they've discussed Nelly prior to now for her to say, Oh, she's beginning to see that. Oh, I guess Chinwe said Nelly is 40. And she's now telling Chinwe that I'm beginning to see that 40 through through that year, day 40. And Chinwe said, Well, let's just give her 33. Let's let's give her 33. Chinwe then said that Nelly coming to pick a fight to, with her is just self destruct because coming into the house, that when she saw Nelly, she went to her saying, Oh, Nelly, how far now? You see the carry face for me. You know, being that they had an unfinished business where uh, Chinwe had accused Nelly of stealing her carrot gold. The video is in my channel in case if you want to watch that and here chimu is saying that she did not that you know one thing with this house is that you will just lose guard on your own because she never even had the intention of coming for her or trying to pick a fight with her just normal conversation of her talking about the times you guys called her isabotoa and you fell into that trap and started exchanging words with her immediately coming even to her presence to confront her I have to say exactly that that's one thing with the house that you unconsciously lose guard on your own because imagine OC coming to tell her that food has been portioned, food has been shared. So are you expecting her to enter into the diary room and ask Big Brother for food or tell Big Brother, oh, help me and buy so 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 and so so so? That in fact, as long as she's there, anytime she's hungry, she will go into that kitchen and cook whatever she wants. That the food she even wants to eat. Is Wani's food. But it's unfortunate to say she don't enter. Wani don't break waist. In fact, that she's still going to break leg and break hand. She would then ask to Ruti, do you plan having a conversation with Wani regarding all that have happened? And Ruti said, honestly, no. Because she does not think that what she told Wani warrants all of this drama. So she's not planning to have a conversation with Wani. And she would then told Ruti that you know that Wani is working on eggshell. That she won't fall into that your trap. That the only way you can get her is to have a conversation with her. Make her, you know, drop her guts. Make her comfortable. And then you strike. That that's the only way she can get into your trap. And I'm like, wow. <laughs> So imagine making a comeback to the house. I guess when they were coming back, Big Brother said, oh, spice the house, right? Big Brother gave them that assignment to spice the house. But is this what you really want to do with, with a second chance? Well, it didn't just end there. After their conversation, they went into the kitchen and, you know, they were discussing with O.C. O.C. was trying to put them through the week's wager preparation. And then Ruti opened <laughs> opened a pot of pot of semo that Nelly had made and then said, Now chef make this one no. Oh. Now chef make semo with this way strong like I've forgotten the word she used. Like she mocked <laughs> the semo that Nelly prepared. So in summary, we can just say that Ruti is here for violence because from Wani to talking about Nelly <laughs> <laughs> for calling her saying oh look at Nachef make this one being that you yourself we are also a chef 
so i guess at this point i don't even know who ruth is here for still the end there so ruthie dami and chiwi are telling the housemates about the spare marks in their bed spread and they were pointing to certain beds saying oh why this why that's like oh sujit pulling out game sujit is withdrawal game and i'm like what and here is ozi trying to tell them that how are you sure this is s how are you sure it is what you're referring to and i think they are very sure are they kids can't you see it? well dam even took a step forward by asking ozi what is this thing with victoria and ozi then turned to dami lola saying oh now you want gist but you you know bring gist you came out from the outside and no gist and here you are looking for gist no that it's a gist for a gist and then we say no you know sh tell me what's the thing with uh, victoria and those they said well it's just a soft spot not nothing much that they're just friends and maybe do you think otherwise do you have a proof from the outside to say otherwise why it's not just a mere friendship and also even took it further by telling uh dami that he has a soft spot for victoria that the victoria the housemates are getting to know in week nine is the victoria he has already discovered and seen even in the earliest week of their stay in the house so that was not like so are you saying oh you connected with victoria like you moved towards Victoria uh, more than uh, the rest of the housemates. For you to say the housemates are just getting to know Victoria means that you've had a deeper connection with Victoria that the housemates are just getting to see now that the show is rounding up. And they said, no, it's, it's just me telling you that we are friends, okay? And I have zero idea why you're asking this question. I have zero idea of what is going out on the outside but what i've learned about is just about people's perception and narrative that most times people just want to run a narrative on your head without even coming to meet you one-on-one -on -one to ask and let me say this is exactly what i'm doing now i'm having a conversation one-on-one -on -one, telling you to tell me what's between the both of you is that not what i'm doing well ozzy said is nothing that is just the house the house has a way of making little things matter and have more meaning that if you that's what he's saying you know just maintain a conversation with tofa from now up until sunday and see the narrative that will be popping out from just having you know spending time with tofa especially with the fact that the both of you had something going on before you left just try it and see if there won't be a perception or a narrative coming up from that that even uh your, your toyosi that had it been toyosi was still here maybe by now this whole narrative going on between him and victoria will even be between him and toyosi being that toyosi was the first person he connected and genuinely cared for because then toyosi would just come to him and ask him oh ozzy ozzy are you okay how are you doing are you sure you're fine checking up on you that maybe had it been toyosi made it to the next week they could have bonded more just like he's doing with victoria and Onyeka. but then it's fine that this question you asked him just gave him an idea of what is going on on the outside and he knows he will be doing a lot of explanation when he will be out of here and he's ready for it because nobody is going to define himself for him so he will do the whole explanation involved well after this dami lola retired to bed and it was just victoria and ozzy ozzy asked victoria to help him uh with his legs he wants to get eyes and massage his legs he has an injury and victoria is telling him is you know where you were fighting position with me why don't you just allow me win techno you were there it was you know between you and i now again um this one that they did today the bank bet still my team and your team why can't you just allow me <laughs> win this thing but she guessed the pain is worth the price and also said no it doesn't too because he's actually feeling pains all over his legs and cassia uh, victoria then jokingly said next time do not drag wins with me from there the conversation moves to how many tasks they've won strategies in the house who the house is favoring and who the house is not favoring who is being vocal and who is not being vocal who is keeping things and who is not keeping things 
was it telling victoria how guarded she is how she does not even want to share certain things about herself and victoria is saying no that is not that she's been too uptight that there is nothing to share although ozzy thinks otherwise well after their convo they both retired to bed that's it on part one of our after pool party highlights do well to watch the part two and now what do you think about ruti and chingwe's strategy regarding nelly and wani and another thing i want to ask is well it's not necessary i wanted to ask chingwe is always talking about nelly's body how strong it is how you know bikish it is but i'm not seeing those descriptions and besides their their bodies that's chingwe and nelly actually look the same in my eyes i don't know <laughs> maybe it's too much gary <laughs> but i don't know though their backside actually look the same in my eyes but let me hear your opinion let me read what you have to say regarding this whole issue and do well to watch the part two and if you haven't watched that video of kelly ray and cassia please do well to watch all of them as well watch like subscribe share thank you and i'll see you in my next video enjoy the rest of your day bye well, girl, talk to me like that girl that little budget mistake don't, don't call her that i even can't get the opportunity to come back see that idiot they tell you